himself today. For the first time in 20 years, it says here, it's John Peel in Whoopee, the daylight. Yes. Newsbeat. Actually, that's 23 years. Hello, fans. It's gorgeous pouting John Peel sitting in for Jackie Brambles and bringing you two and a quarter hours of top tunes for all the family. Here's one now. When you're doing a daytime programme, you talk over the end of records like this. This is the best band in the entire world, but you probably know that anyway. The Fall, Why Are People Grudgeful, their current single. And they're appearing at Sheffield Sound City in 93 uh, on April the 7th, Wednesday by any other name. And for ticket details, any other information you might want, you have to call 0891 333 464. And that's uh, 36p cheap rate, 48p the, I suppose, the expensive rate. That's 0891 333 Go and see them. I wish I could myself. And already many, many people have sent us faxes saying, that sounds an interesting song, John. Where does it come from? Well, it comes from here. <laughs>
That's the great Joe Gibbs trading as Sir Gibbs on this occasion. People are grudgeful, and it comes from an LP called the Reggae Train, 1968 to 1971. And I have some weather for you here. Many places will have showers tonight, uh, although these will be well scattered in the southeast. Some northern areas will have quite a wet night. Southern and central regions will be fairly windy, with gales near some western coasts. Tomorrow, it will still be windy and showery in many districts, although mostly dry. Bright weather will spread slowly from the south and west during the day. And the winds will die down later. And I hope it doesn't rain too much in East Anglia because our bathroom uh, roof is leaking. And this is a demonstration of the petty bourgeois lifestyle that we DJs have because we have a bathroom. In when you come out through to my window, so they put me in the back of the car at the station. From that point, I'm a risk my destination. So in farmer, you know, say that I'm a snowman, I go play. I like it, boom, boom, damn. Take the man that says, say that I'm a snowman, stop somewhere down the lane. I like it, boom, boom, damn. In farmer, you know, say that I'm a snowman, I go play. I like it, boom, boom, damn. Take the man that says, say that I'm a snowman, stop somewhere down the lane. I like it, boom, boom, damn. So big on the man, they think they have more power. The pan of four, me say dead one, I want me for what I use, the ones and I me call me lover. Love who me calling on the ones that me, I me love you, my heart down to my belly. Yes, and I'm a snowman, I feel cool and deadly. Yes, the one MC Shan and the one that is snow. Together we all have a miss a tornado in farmer. You know, say that I'm a snowman, I go play. I like it, boom, boom, damn. Take the man that says, say that I'm a snowman, start somewhere down the lane. I like it, boom, boom, damn. In farmer. Never left for a tally. You say that it's no me, I'd run dance man. Rum it in a dance, I'll lay in a nation. You never know, say that I'm a snow me, I'd be boom shaka. Tell me, never lay you down flat, and now I'm can't go down. You say that I'm a snow me, I go reaching at the top. So in farmer, you know, say that I'm a snow me, I go blam. I like it, boom boom, damn. Take the man that say that I'm a snow me, stop some more down the lane. I like it, boom boom, damn. In farmer. This is our party on Radio 1.
Annie Lennox on 1FM, that's Little Bird, and before that it was Snow and the current single Informer. And there are going to be pop records in the course of these programmes, but no Simply Red. Is that the sound of distant cheering that I hear? And part of my contractual agreement with the BBC before doing these programmes was that I should be allowed to play every afternoon a record by PJ Harvey, and here's this afternoon's. Trudged wearily through the sifting snow, their hands plunged deeply into their pockets. They both wished, oh, how they wished, they could be sitting snugly by the open hearth, watching the fire crackling merrily, sipping their steaming mugs of scalding hot cocoa. Never mind, Judy, said Beatrice incoherently. It'll soon be summer. Mean. One of the great bands of all time, those are the Undertones, and on my regular programmes for 1FM, we have bands coming in and they record in BBC Studios three or four songs which get broadcast and occasionally issued on uh, LP. They're called Sessions, and that was from a session that the Undertones recorded in 1979. Here comes the summer, that's a real DJ-style joke when it's pouring with rain. And before that, it was uh, PJ Harvey, her current single, 50 Foot Queenie. <laughs> Put 
That's Madonna, of course, and her version of Fever. And I'll play you the original now. Not, as you're probably thinking, not that Peggy Lee record. No, no, no. The original was by Little Willie John and was one of the great records of all time. Take this 
Shotbound sound on 1FM. That's uh, Underground Resistance. It's called The Storm from uh, an EP called Shockwave. And before that, from that golden year, 1956, it was Little Willie John and the original version of Fever. Here's some traffic stuff for you. On the M6 in Cheshire, watch out for northbound delays at the legendary Thelwall Viaduct between Junction 20 and 21 because of emergency repairs. And this, combined with major roadworks on the same stretch, will mean northbound tailbacks for much of the afternoon. Also in Cheshire, the northbound entry slipped from the A51 to the A55 at Vickers Cross near Chester. It's closed for emergency roadworks until late afternoon. Delays likely. In Northamptonshire, the westbound access to the A14 from the A509 is closed on the approach to Kettering at Pitchley, allow for delays throughout the day. And drivers using the Berkshire section of the M4 should allow for eastbound hold-ups between junctions 5 and 6 near West Drayton because of an earlier accident. Now something quiet and lovely so you can touch one another. <laughs> Just where you're wrong, pal. I can take the CD off and throw it as far as I possibly can. That's what happens when you get a computer to write your songs. That's Chris Isaac, and uh, can't do a thing to stop me. And one of the most interesting artists that I've discovered this year is somebody who made her last record in about 1950, I think, but I'd never heard of her previously until I got hold of a CD called Specialty Legends of Boogie Woogie. Her name's Camille Howard, and when she plays the piano, it stays played. <laughs>
wouldn't you love to be in a pub or somewhere where there's a piano and somebody say, anybody play the piano? And you sit down and do that. That's wonderful stuff. Camille Howard and the Fireball Boogie. And you'll hear Camille Howard every afternoon on these programmes for the entire week. And uh, in just a moment, the Human League. 1FM presents Sound City 93. Tonight, live from Sheffield. This is Mark Goodyear. This evening, I'll feature back-to-back live performances from Kingmaker, The Franklin Walters, Pulp, Cut, and The Wedding Present. And we'll catch up with all the day's events on day one of Sound City 93. Direct from the centre of Sheffield to the centre of your FM dial. Tonight, from 7. 1FM's evening session. A music frenzy. was a number one in 1981 when I was about, oh, about that high and as pretty as a picture. That's Human League, of course, and Don't You Want Me. And uh, one of the bands playing at Sheffield Sound City, 93, uh, actually on Friday, the 9th of April, Sunscream, and they go something like this.
Sheffield on Friday, sunscreen, and that's pressurous. It's 1.30 on 24 Hour 1 FM, and Richard Evans has the news. IRA suspect Nesson Quinlivan is not going to be extradited to Britain at the moment. It's just been confirmed that he's to face firearms charges in Ireland first. He's being moved from Limerick, where he was arrested yesterday, to Dublin for a court appearance later today. The man shot dead in County Down this morning has been named as William Killen, a 36-year-old Protestant father of two. The United Nations is planning a mass evacuation of Srebrenica in eastern Bosnia. It's going to send in daily convoys and hopes to bring out 10,000 people. Britain, British and French fishermen have been meeting in Cherbourg over their fishing row. They agreed that the, their governments must act now to settle the arguments. The government's issued new guidelines on medical staff who are HIV positive. It says all patients should be told if they're being treated by a person with the virus. Hoover says it's working flat out to sort out the free flight mess. It says a rescue package will be announced as soon as possible. Bookies William Hill aren't going to sue over the Grand National fiasco. The Jockey Club has started an inquiry into Saturday's race. That's it. There's more from the 1FM newsroom at 2.30.
Well, that's a plum behind me. Whispers in the shadows, rock blazing voices, hating, waiting. Hey, boy, hey, girl. Have you got any money? But I say it. I'm gonna take money and I take a white curry. I'm on the way home to my wife. Shipping on in the country and now she's expecting me. But I see her glass, she said, pulling out the coke. I'm down in a two-star set up in the head. First felt a fist And then a kick I could now smell their breath The smell of pubs And wormwood scrubs And too many right-wing meetings My life swam around me It took a look and drowned me In exotic existence The smell of brown leather With the weather, though my eyes is not a mouth of blood, so my sex is good. See, here, speaking around me, I'm now in a two-step shadow of midnight. I said I'm walking in a two-step shadow of midnight. You keep reading that they're going to get back together again, and I think they should, frankly. If you can write stuff as good as that in 1978, you can write it as well in 1993, I think. The jam down in the tube station at midnight. I don't know what your feelings were about the Grand National, and I'm not much of a one for horse racing myself, but if all horse racing meetings were like uh, the National meeting, you'd not be able to keep me away from it, frankly. <laughs>
You get it out of your system, gal. That's uh, Sybil, and when I'm good and ready. And if you want to send us a fax, and quite a lot of people have done, and they do actually get read, I can promise you that, uh, you send them to 71 2476 I know that there are some people who don't have fax machines. It seems extraordinary, doesn't it, in 1993 that this should be so, but it is. But if you have one, or access to one, it's 71 2476 And somebody who did send in a fax earlier on was uh, Max Ellis from London uh, W4. More scratchy records, please, he said. I think this will suit you down to the ground, Max. The very first time that I saw your brown eyes Your lips said hello and I said I I knew right there you were the one But I was caught up in physical attraction But to my satisfaction Baby, you were more than just a friend And if I ever fall in love again yeah. I will be sure yeah. that the lady is a friend If I ever fall in love so true I will be sure yeah. that the lady comes like you Oh, my, 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 my That I could be your one and only. Promise, 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 promise you will never leave me lonely. I just wanna be the one you need. I just wanna be the one to serve you. Sometimes I feel I don't deserve you. Cherish every moment that we share. And if I And I said, I, I knew right there you were the one But I was caught up in physical attraction But to my satisfaction, baby, you were more than just a friend And if I like that. That's from Kingston, Jamaica on the Jamento record label, Anthony Malvo. And I have to owe you a bit of a I owe you a bit of an apology, dear listener, because uh, as you can probably tell, I'm wheezing slightly, and this is because I've got some kind of disgusting respiratory uh, disease. And it's strange how your body at times like this turns into a kind of snot generator, and it's really irritating that it should happen on a day when it's my big chance in showbiz. But I shall press on nevertheless. This is uh, the G- I'll just do a wheeze once more for you to demonstrate the extent of my pain. This is the Jesus and Mary chain.
for a second week. The Bluebells, Young at Heart, is the UK's biggest selling single. This is Bruno Brooks on Sunday. I revealed 11 new top 40 hits, including Duran Duran. Aerosmith. And into the top 10 for Sub Sub. Join me every Sunday at 4 for the official news first. some rather pathetic link between this and Sheffield as well. I think it was recorded in Sheffield or something and it gives me another opportunity to mention Sheffield Sound City 93, but you may well be fed up with hearing that, so I'll give it a miss on this occasion. That was Sub Sub, featuring Melanie Williams. Ain't no love, ain't no use. And here's a record that you probably won't know, but is particularly beautiful, something rather quieter. Uh, Fat John's Bit in the Middle. This is uh, a record by Madder Rose, and it's called Madder Rose. <laughs>
Tomorrow's hits today on 1FM. That's Madder Rose and a record called Madder Rose, although when they recorded it again for an LP, they called it Swim, just to make things really difficult. That's on Rockville Records, an import from the United States of America. And one thing that unites all of the greater Europe in these grisly times is, uh, well, uh, 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 appalling football songs. And each uh, day of this week, I should be playing you one. This is the Dukla Prague song. <laughs> Je nečas nebo slunce září, najdu lisku srdce dávne nás, snad se podaří, dva vody rukle získat zas. Těch jedenáct voků, když to rozbalí, bouříme na všem dní, na tří to umí všem, když má jí den. Už zase hřištěm zmí Ten pocit radiční Vyť dukle fandí rád Kdo je znalec a správný klad Když dukla vyhrá make you feel kind of humble, doesn't it? That's the Dukla Prague song, and I can't even give you the name of the artist, because there isn't one on the record, but it was composed by Bello Hubeck and Navordnik, who asked for 42 similar offences to be taken into consideration. I don't talk about fo- football very much this season as a lifelong Liverpool supporter, so I'll just play you another record. This is Altered Images. <laughs>
used to love them with the love that passeth all understanding. That's altered images, and uh, I could be happy. And one thing that I do know as a regular listener to 1FM is that you like quiz questions. So here's one for you. What's the capital of Peru? Tennessee. Close. Tennessee. 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 Lord, I've really been real stressed. Down and out. Down the Peace Street. Headliner, I challenge you to a game of horseshoes. A game of horseshoes. Now I see the importance of history. While my people be in the mess that they be. Many journeys to freedom made in vain. My brothers on the corner playing ghetto games. I ask you, Lord, why you enlighten me without the enlightenment of all my folks. He said, cause I set myself on a quest for truth. And he was there to quench my thirst. But I am still thirsty. Lord, allow me to drink some more. He said what I am searching for are the answers to all which are in front of me. That's arrested development, as you must surely know by now, in Tennessee. And somewhere out there in the wild blue yonder is the man of Zeke. Are you hearing me, man of Zeke? Hey, John, how you doing? You're so sounding brilliant, John Well, I, I, I think so. What can I say? You know, well, what are you doing? Where are I'm you? I'm out here, man. I'm in, I'm in between the raindrops in downtown Dumfries in sunny Scotland. Let me hear you say, yo, no! <laughs> Hey, John, I'm here collecting Easter eggs, man, and I'm taking them down to the, um, the Huddersfield, I mean, um, the <laughs> pedestrian area in, uh, or wherever in the town it is, yeah. I'll be in Huddersfield tomorrow. Right. You know? And uh, we've got loads of eggs here, man. You're like, everybody's been going out shopping and buying eggs for Zeke, man. I'm the Zeke bunny. Let me hear you say yeah one more time. Yeah! Okay. All right, what's your name? I'm Grief. All right, well, you... you. Kieran Grief. All right. Come on up here. Come on up here, big man. Put up. Buddha. <laughs> Big Buddha. All right, I want some of the, some of the Dumfries ladies. Dumfries ladies, come on up here and say hello. Come on. All right, you want me to come down here? All right, I'll come down. Hello, little lady. How you doing? Fine. What's your name? Monty. Are you, are you, you, do you like Easter eggs? I. I. <laughs> she just ate a wee one. <laughs> Hi, how you doing, lady? Fine, nice. All right, you're Dumfries lady, huh? No. Where are you from? Here. You're from here. And what are you doing down here? Holiday. Right. So, is Dumfries a holiday center? We're at Southern Ness. Uh-huh. All right. And you've got a, a wonderful, worldwide, famous poet from, from, from Dumfries. Did you know that? Um, what, what's, your, what's your poet's name from, from Dumfries? Let me see if you know. Robert Burns. Robert. Say it one more time. Robert Burns. I love that. Burns. <laughs> I love it. And Robert Burns, he says that uh, man's inhumanity to man makes countless thousands mourn. And I, I really love that slogan. That's really good. Robert Burns, this lady here, you got, I like your plates. Come here, darling. Come here. Come and say hello to me. How you doing? Fine, thanks. What's your name? Tina. 
Where you from? From Freeze. Now, uh, is unemployment bad here or are you all working? I'm working. Oh, good. So I choose one that's working. Where do you work? An accountant. You're an accountant? All right. So that goes for all them beads in your hair, huh? You can get that done. Cost a few bucks that day. Yeah, making money. All right. Dumb phrase, one love to you all. All right. And we got more eggs coming in. We got loads and loads of eggs coming in. And this lady with the umbrella, come on over here. Come on, come on over here. Okay, through the raindrops. Hi. How you doing? Fine. What's your name? Karen. Karen, say hello to John Peel. Hello. <laughs> Very good, Karen. I'm impressed. <laughs> Hugely impressed. By that. Get him to say yo one more time. Hey, I, all right, Dumfries, I want you to give John Peel and everybody who's listening right now around the world one of the biggest yo's you have ever yo. Let me hear you say yo! <laughs> Is that cool, John? That's pretty good. Hey, John, tomorrow I'm going to be in Ottersfield. Ottersfield, look out. Bring me an egg. You hear what I'm saying? John, your show is cool. Keep the vibes going. One love. Dumfries, bye! Yeah! All right, I'm going down to the hospital now with all these eggs. Bye, everybody. See you, John.
This is called Feel Your Need by L Doper. It's on Joint Effort Records out of East Barnet in Hertfordshire. The man has eats like that all the time, you know. He hasn't slept since June 1974. And later on today, he'll go south. But here on 1FM, we go west. That's the kind of Radio 2 announcement that you like to get in every once in a while. Radio 2 style late. They have a way with the song, don't they? One of these days, perhaps they'll get to sing one. Just kidding. <laughs> Go west, and that's called Still in Love, and we've got a bunch of weather here. Uh, tonight, many places will have showers, and although these will be well scattered in the southeast, some northern areas will have quite a wet night. Southern and central regions will be fairly windy, with gales near some western coasts. Tonight, it will still be windy and showery in many districts, although mostly dry. Bright weather will spread slowly from the south and west during the day, and the winds will die down later.
сегодняшней программе Джон Пил будет передавать сессию группы The Breeders, а также он будет играть музыку многих групп, которые вы никогда не слышали раньше и которые, вероятно, вам не очень-то понравятся. Предыдущая песня исполняла группа The Wicked Ones, а следующая это Гуру Джош. Do you know, things were going so enormously well and I was bound to make a mistake and I think I've just made it. Well, there you go. you to know that I made that mistake there, not because I'm getting cocky or thinking that this sitting in for Jackie Bramble's lark is a doddle, but because I think it's cute and I want you to love me. That was Depeche Mode, Condemnation from the LP Songs of Faith and Devotion and don't forget for details of Depeche Mode's uh, July gig at Crystal Palace, you can call the 1FM concert line on 0891 979990 that's 36p the cheap rate, 48p the uh, well, the expensive rate, 0891 979990 and time for an album uh, chart Rundown. My goodness me, I've never had to do one of these before either. Uh, number 20, it's Michael Jackson and Dangerous. At 19, the Bliss album, PM Dawn. At 18, it's Coverdale Page. At 17, a real live one, Iron Maiden. 13, 10 Summoner's Tales. That's Sting, of course. At 12, Taxi, Brian Ferry. At uh, 11, Ingenue, K.D. Lang. Rather pretentious title, I think. At number 10, the very best of Randy Crawford. Nothing pretentious about that. See if you can guess who it's by. At number 9, So Close, Dina Carroll. At number 8, Automatic for the People, R.E.M. At number 7, D. Annie Lennox. And at number six, a new entry, cover shot, David Essex. At number five, unplugged, Eric Clapton, if only. At number four, Are You Gonna Go My Way, Lenny Kravitz. At number three, their greatest hits, Hot Chocolate. At number two, Songs of Faith and Devotion, Depeche Mode, you just heard them. And straight in at number one, Suede.
Clever Coves, there's no getting away from that. And big favourites on the Mark Goodyear programme on 1FM, that's Suede. Their LP straight in at number one, that was Animal Nitrate. Voice of the Beehive and Jimmy Somerville. for the Beehive and Jimmy Somerville, their version of Gimme Shelter. And whenever you get an LP that's called something like Rockabilly, Forgotten Classics, or Idaho's Top Rockabilly Bands, or something like that, when you hear the tracks, you know it's, they're forgotten because they were terrible. But I got one earlier this year, which is genuinely good and full of people that you'd never heard of in your life. It's called Get With The Beat, The Marvel Masters, A Lost Decade of American Rock and Roll. And this is a chap called Harry Carter, the rock and roll Apache, Jump Baby Jump. <laughs> Hold on. 
That's the way to do it, isn't it? Harry Carter, the rock and roll Apache, and Jump Baby Jump. It's 2.30 on 24-hour 1FM, and Emma Howard has the news. Suspect Nesson Quinn Liven is to face charges in Ireland before an extradition proceedings are considered. He escaped from Brixton Prison last July and is wanted in Britain on charges of conspiracy to murder. This afternoon, he's due to appear in court in Dublin, charged with possession of a pistol. A man who was shot dead in County Down this morning has been named by police as William Killen, a 36-year-old Protestant father of two. He was shot by gunmen who forced their way into his flat in the village of Portagovi. Pressure is mounting on Education Secretary John Patton to abandon this summer's national curriculum tests. Last week, a court upheld the NASUWT's right to boycott the exams. Now two more unions are threatening to join the boycott. Labour's education spokeswoman, Ann Taylor. I think that for once in his life, the Secretary of State should accept that he has been wrong, admit it, and say that this year's test should be a voluntary, unreported pilot with those schools taking part if the teachers in their school feel it is appropriate. I don't think that he should be imposing these tests in which teachers don't have confidence, parents don't have confidence, and I certainly think that it's time for the Secretary of State to climb down. United Nations forces in Bosnia are preparing to evacuate up to 15,000 civilians from Srebrenica. The town has been besieged by Serbs for a year, and tens of thousands of Muslims there are starving. From tomorrow, 20 lorries a day are to go into Srebrenica loaded with food. They'll come out carrying the sick and wounded, the elderly and women with small children. UN spokeswoman Lindel Sachs. We need a minimum of 39 metric tons of food going in daily just to sustain a basic level of nutrition for the population. If this does not get in, the population is going to starve. So clearly if you reduce the population pressures in Srebrenica by assisting with the evacuation of individuals who do wish to leave, it will only be to the benefit of the rest of the population. Finally, an Irish woman is toasting her luck today after winning a fortune on the Grand National that never was. Caroline McCarthy from Glanmere and County Cork forgot to nominate a horse when she entered a competition sponsored by the Racing Post. Under the complicated rules of the game, she won the jackpot, more than £150,000. That's it for now, John. Next update at 3.30.
One FM, well, the hits keep happening. Those are the faces from 1971. Stay with me. And if you weren't listening to that so loud that your ears are now bleeding, then you've missed the point entirely. The best live gig that I ever saw in my life, and I can say that quite categorically, featured the fe- faces. And they played in Sunderland the night that Sunderland had beaten, beaten I think it was Arsenal. There were one or two One FM producers who could confirm that for me. But in the semi final of the Cup, and uh, the faces were playing in Sunderland, and the entire place was like floating three or four feet above the ground, and the faces were the perfect band to capture the atmosphere. I'm not much of a dancing man myself, not got the physique for it really but I ended up dancing on stage with them quite wonderful. Earlier in the programme I mentioned these sessions which are recorded for my regular programmes on uh, 1FM Friday night, Saturday night, 11 till 2 in the morning just a little uh, advertisement for them there and uh, one of the very best sessions we had last year came from Fundamental, I think they're about to record another one today or tomorrow, this is their current record, this is a stormer so leave your radios turned up loud. Never, 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 the wrath of the black man, the black man.
By frequency modulation, these relay programs are transmitted from station to station, from city to city, and from mountaintop to mountaintop without telephone connections by means of crystal clear FM. Yeah. Oi, man. Yo. Shine it again. Whatever now, show you, man. Back to back. We are getting it right now. Really, no. Now, our crew, you know, we have a big enough scene. So, just one step up in live on Strive said we are here. Yes. Don't drink coffee, I drink roots, my dear. And I love my morning ride. You can see it in my motions when I walk. I'm a Jamaican in New York. See me walking down Church Avenue. With my hat lean to one side. crowd of people in Jamaica and in New York. Before that, it was the very wonderful Fundamental, spelled fun hyphen da hyphen mental, and Wrath of the Black Man, their current single, which is on Nation Records. And another one of our regular spots this week, while I sit in for Jackie Brammels here on 1FM, is going to be our new Nirvana spot, because almost every band that comes out of America these days is described to you as the new Nirvana. And today's is Motorola.
This is Motorola from Raleigh, North Carolina on Blaster Plateau Records. Uh, sort of LucasAid coloured vinyl, 7-inch single called Congratulations. And I'll have another new Nirvana for you on tomorrow's uh, tomorrow afternoon's programme. This is Michael Jackson. Doing some serious guitaring, Michael Jackson, of course, and give in to me. And uh, Gary Davis limbering up in the adjoining studio because he's sitting in for Steve Wright this week. And uh, of course, I'm John Peel, I'm sitting in for Jackie Brambles. 
I've got one more record to play. It requires a bit of explanation, really, because I know it's an amazingly stupid thing to say that somebody is the best guitarist in the world. But if there is such a person, it could well be Diblo Dybala, who's based in Paris, comes originally, I think, from Zaire. And uh, he used to be in a band called Laketo, and the track I'm going to play here now features some of the most astonishing guitar playing I've ever heard in my entire life. And what they do on these things, Sukus it's called, and what they do is, uh, when they're playing live, you know, they'll play the same figure over and over and over and over again to build up the tension and then just explode into these extraordinary tunes. And he does this about three minutes into this track, which is called Le Joie de Vivre. And this is for my pal Ian the Tank Engine. <laughs>
only the very best for you, my pretties. That's La Quetta, Le Joie de Vivre, with Diblo de Bala on guitar. Uh, it's been hard work, but I've thoroughly enjoyed myself, I must admit. And it's uh, over to you, Gary. <laughs> that's it? That's it, yes, that's, that's it. Am I supposed to do that, something else? That's it. That's it, yeah. yeah. And, and it's over to you, Gary. That's right. Fine. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you.